Safari Gelili of all time. Asanteni sana kwa watu ambao mnaendelea kusubscribe na kushare our videos. Mungu awabariki sana sana sana. Let's go back to the topic ya leo. Uh, last time tuliongelea kuhusu vaginal dryness na sababu gani zinasababisha vaginal dryness? Tukaziongelea na pia tukaongelea organic ways za kuongeza vaginal wetness. So leo nikasema kwamba next topic tutaenda kuongelea vitu ambavyo ni out of vya kula lakini pia zinasaidia sana kuongeza vaginal wetness au vinaweza vikatumika au vikakontroliwa ili kuongeza vaginal wetness. Ah uh, tunajua kwamba sexual activity inahitaji sana akili ya mtu kuwepo pale kuwa connected tofauti na any other activity you know you know what i mean kwa hiyo kama mtu au mwanamke pia katika sexual activity lakini akili yake haiko pale means the down part of hers itakuwa haziko connected na ilo tendo unakuta mtu yuko pale lakini anaanza vikoba anaanza madeli anamwaza mama ali sio anamdai kitu gani anaanza sio kuna mkopo gani alichukua sehemu fulani unaona kwa hiyo akili yake haiko pale she is not connected to the to the thing she is not connected to that what she is doing at the at the moment obviously obviously the down part won't work as it atua ile wetness inayohitajika kwa sababu akili haiko pale kinachofanyika kinachofanya kazi sana ni ubongo wake kwa sababu ubongo wake unafikiria vitu vya nje ambavyo ni out of what she is doing on the bed i mean on the bed at that moment so kwa hiyo kama msichana au uko yo yo just going to your guy make sure akili yako iko connected na what you're going to do at the moment hakikisha akili yako iko connected hakikisha akili yako iko pale kwenye tendo acha na kufikiria madeni najua ule ni muda kwa enjoy you know eh muda wa kuenjoy unatakiwa kufikiria madeni sijui ya nani mwanzo kumfikiria sijui nani hapana acha na hayo mambo kwa hiyo kama mkaka pia ukiona demo wako au mwanamke wako kila siku mko naye lakini unaona mara kila siku yuko mkavu tu yuko mkavu tu kama ungea naye muulize unajua mapenzi ni kuenjoy watu watu wawili sawa kwa hiyo usiwe so selfish kwa una enjoy wewe tu peke yako ukamsahau na hiyo muongea naye muulize shida ni nini shida iko wapi you know hivyo man kama ni mtu ambaye yuko very open atakuelezea labda na kazi za ofisini zimenibana au nilikuwa sitaki kufanya leo nilikuwa nataka uniache kwanza nipumzike you know vitu kama hivyo na ni vitu vya kuongea kama you know partners naona kwa hiyo mahusiano ni ni, ni ni the partnership ambacho watu wawili mmekubaliana kuingia katika mkataba. Kwa kwenye mkataba huo inabidi wote muwe masikilizana. Sio mtu mmoja tu anaitoa tamko kwa ajili ya mwingine. So kama siko nikwambia baby you know, I'm not ready to do this. Msikilize. Kwa sababu unajua kama ha, hayuko ready means hata akili yake au the down part of hers hazijajiandaa, haziko ready. Kwa hiyo unajikuta unaenda una, una you doing unaenda unafanya iko kitendo mwisho siku anachubuka, mwisho siku haenjoy, yani inakuwa kama kitu ambacho viko post kama kubakwa. You see? Sawa. Kwa hiyo kitu kingine ambacho unatokea watu tukaotoa sana ni akili zetu na mind zetu katika tendo kama mtu you are going to do that thing. Ah uh, kitu kingine ambacho unatokea kuwa very controlled ni kuandaliwa kama mtoto wa kiume inabidi umwandae vizuri mtoto wako wa kike au demo wako au mwanamke wako vizuri. Sisi na game tofauti na nyinyi. Nyinyi kama gari ukiwasha tu utakuta inawaka. Lakini sisi it's take time ni kama umeosha gari unatakiwa uangalie maji kama yapo uangalie mafuta yako vizuri uangalie engine oils tu uangalie wipes sisi nini 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 nyo you know eh tofauti na sisi yani nyinyi na sisi ni tofauti sana nyinyi dakika mbili mbele mshawaka lakini sisi it's take time so use that moment to pressure your baby yani ujue kabisa hapa when i'm going to touch my baby the care najua atashtuka nikimshika sehemu fulani atashtuka take time to learn yani chukua muda umwangalie demo yako mwanamke wako ujifunze sehemu gani na sehemu gani ambazo unajua nikimshika anashtuka nikifanya nikim, hiki na hiki na hiki najua mwanamke wangu ana enjoy you see kisha sema mahusiano ni i mean it's a partnership so mtu mmoja ndo anatakiwa apate advantages partnership inabidi at the end of the day kama ni kuenjoy na enjoy 50 50 sawa so, it's a 50 50 thing so long to mgeana na enjoy sim ya tisini mgeana enjoy sim ya 10 hapana it's not like that you know it's not like that hiyo bu a period sawa so, go take your time kumwandaa demo yako vizuri 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 ah uh, pia kitu kingine ambacho nimekuja kuki nime nimekuja kukijua ambacho kinasaidia sana kwenye vaginal wetness ni vaginal steam hubs hizi ni dawa za asili ambazo mimi personally nimezitumia kwa muda mrefu mpaka nikaanza kuziuza mimi naziuza hizi dawa Yaani nimestudia kwa muda mrefu sana mpaka nikaanza kuziuza kwa sababu nimeona advantages zake. Raha ya vaginal steam hub ni organic. 
ni dawa za asili ambazo zinasaidia sana kwenye kuongeza wetness na sio tu kuongeza wetness na kujafanyia review kuhusu hizi herbs uh, ni kuelezeni faida zake kiujumla na anuelezeni uh, namna gani ya kutumia lakini kikubwa mjui kwamba vaginal steam herbs ni mojawapo ya products ambazo zinasaidia sana sana kwenye kuongeza vaginal wetness na si mimi peke yangu ambao nimeonyesha au nimetoa hizi feedback pia ni wataji wangu wameweza kustupiwa wanasema namna gani wanawaliza wakakazaa huko pia. Inza mtazamaji mpaka natamani nyingine isiwe kwenye zile hubs na ikiwa sana bidi niweke na kamera ambacho mtu akitatumia akienda kule na mimi naanza kuona watu wanavolia, you know. <laughs> I'm kidding yo. Yeah, I'm kidding. Ili nione namna gani my guys, our brothers are enjoying the cookies vizuri, you know. Kwa hiyo hizi ni nzuri kwa sababu ni organic hazina kemikali yoyote ile na pia ni rahisi sana kuzitumia kikubwa tu ni kupata masharti ya namna ya kuzitumia utakiwi kutumia vaginal steam herbs ukiwa umezichemsha ule mvuke kutiki kuwa wa moto sana not mvuke wake hautakiwi kuwa wa moto mpaka unaisi kuungua mvuke unatakiwa watu ule wa kawaida in a medium way ambayo you don't to kuungua you know eh ukiwa umekaa kwa sababu you are steaming your down parts you know una steam uke wako kwa hiyo unatakiwa kuungua you know uke una nyama laini sana kwa kama mvuke ukoa wa moto sana lazima utaungua kwa kama ukiwa a medium way uta enjoy kwa sababu pia inakonnect well with your inner body inakufanya ini you feel that type of way ambayo najua ambao anashare kusimu anaelewa yani ukiwa na steam unatakiwa uwe uwe very ready to connect yourself with your inner body kwa sababu inakuconnect it's a organic thing. Vitu ambavyo wazazi wetu na babu zetu washawahi kutumia miaka na miaka huko nyuma. Ngoja nikwambieni kitu. Miaka 90 mimi ni miaka 80 huko Kaone za nyuma kulikuwa hamna hizi chemical things au ama dawa ambayo tunapewa sasa hivi kuongeza sikio vya general wetness. Aya madawa wako natumia miti shamba. Miti shamba ndio hizi dawa ambazo mimi naziuza. Ambazo tunaziuza mimi naziuza. Ambazo tunajua faida zake ni nzuri kwa sababu tushazifanyia research na onekana kabisa hizi products ni nzuri na pia ni organic 100%. Yaani 100%. Hamna kemikali yoyote on guard. Hamna kemikali yoyote. Kama mshawe kutumia mnajua kabisa kwamba ni majani majani tu tumechanganya huko. Unajua? Kwa hiyo siku nakuta baby yako anakuta umekalia labda ndo kwa sababu wengine wanatumia ndo kukalia kwenye steam. Anaanza kasa wapi wangu anataka kuniloga au? Lakini ndio hivyo tunawaloga kwenye organic way. So uchawi uchawi ule kwa kwenda kwa waganga hapana ni uchawi wa kutumia dawa za I am Lily's SL. You know, kwa watu ambao washawahi tumia, unaweza kupitia page yetu ya I am Lily's I am in Lily's feminine store, utaandika hapa username, mkaangalie feedback za watu. Sio mimi na it's magazine of feedback ni watu wengine. Muone namna gani inaongeza wetness kwa mwanamke. Wanasema uh, kwenye research ambayo nishaye kuifanya, wanasema ile vagina ukitumia ile steam inaenda kufungua ina open the pores za vagina. Kwa hiyo kama kuna vitu ambavyo sio vizuri, vichafu, vyote vinakuwa vinatoka ndio maana baada ya kusim unakuta tunashauri mtu baada ya kusim masalada sita baadaye. Yaani kama kisha simu sasa hivi, avai pad au avai uh, zinaitwa zile ndogo zinaitwa kuna pads na the other thing though the small ones. Ni msahau kila kitu imagine and I use them every day. Oh my god. I'm getting old. Ah, I can't believe it. Yes, those small ones. <laughs> yeah, pana achana na pads zile nyingine sasa unaweza kafa pads au zile nyingine ndogo. Ukavaa ndani ya masaa sita baada ya kusteam. Kwa sababu kuna wengine ambao wakisha steam wanaanza kupata ile discharges natoka. Za discharge ni zile vitu ambavyo viko ndani ya mwili wako ndani ya vagina ambavyo they are not good. They get me out from your body, you see. Kwa hiyo inasaidia sana connect you with your inner body in pia inaonyesha very good positive effect of feedback after using it na pia inaongeza sana wetness katika mwili wa mwanamke sawa hivyo ndio vitu ambavyo nimesema i will share with you ambavyo sio vya kula kwa ajili ya kuongeza vaginal wetness kikubwa jamani kontroloni stress zenu hakikishieni mabeli zenu wanawaanda hata kama hataki mueleweshe mwambie babu we hii ni partnership we have to enjoy 50-50 kwani wewe ukinikisi shingoni na ukini nani wewe ni shingapi shingapi <laughs> nauliza wafundisheni unajua kuna wengine they don't know namna gani ya kumwandaa mtoto wa kike 
they don't yani hajui kwa na mahusiano ya kuanda yani hajui hajui ni kumwata mwanamke kukoje yani hajui yani completely kwa hiyo kama akikupata wewe unatakiwa umueleweshe mwambie hapa baba mimi napenda unishike hapa naomba unishike that's why mimi class hiyo nasemaka watu tu hakike take your time to explore your bodies jijue mwili wako take your time to learn about your body so kitu kibaya wewe ni mwili wako kila siku uko nao unaenda kuoga uko nao unaenda huko uko nao kwenye kio unajiangalia from head to the toe try to explore it take your time learn your body kuna mimi na sometimes na huwa hadi na share i mean pictures the vagina specimens what did i say oh my god cut <laughs> okay i share pictures ambazo zinaonyesha vaginas na pamoja na majina yake kwa sababu kuna mtu hata apatia ya, ya vagina hajui hajui where is the labia it doesn't know kitu gani ni clitoris hajui chochote kile yani hayoto mwili upo kama ulivyo you know lakini ndio uchukue muda kujifunza na kujua mwili wako Google ipo kwa ajili yetu jamani so Google kila siku huko naangalia poni no siku nyingine kaa pitia pitia ujifunze vitu kuhusu mwili wako jifunze sehemu gani ambazo nikishikwa mtu hakika akishikwa anapewa ashtuke na wewe angalia ah wapi kuna hiki na hiki na hiki okay siku mbili na kama na explore sio kitu kibaya sio kitu kibaya na sio kibaya kwa sababu ni mwili wako na unafanya mwenyewe unajiangalia mwenyewe ili kesho na kesho kutwa kwa na bibi wako anamwambia baby me i think you can ukinishika kiunyayo unasikia raha au kinachika kisogo nasikia raha yani kwa sababu sisi ni wanawake kila mtu anapata ya mwili ambayo anasikia raha baada ya kushika kwa hiyo take your time to explore your body i mean whoever think this is it's not it's a bad knowledge to share you you need you need prayers like literally you need prayers kwa sababu kuna watu ambao they don't know their bodies at all yani hawajui mili yao yani hajui mwili wake ukoje hajui pati gani ya mwili wake iko hivi hivi kwa hiyo hata sometimes unakuta anapata discharges ambazo hazieleweki kwa sababu hajui discharges hizo zinamaanisha nini kwa sababu hajai kuji explore yani mtu akiamka ametoka ameoga amemaliza amerudi amevaa nini hajui hata kujiangalia labda leo discharges zimetoka ya yellow leo imetoka labda ya brownish leo imetoka labda ya rangi nyingine hajui you see na ni mtoto wa kike anajita mtoto wa kike That's why mimi tendelea ku emphasize na kuambia kwamba watoto wa kike kizazi chetu take your time to explore your body. Wewe ni mwili wako na utakuwa nao wewe mwenyewe siku zote. You see? Unaweza ku explore kwa ajili yako, ku explore kwa ajili ya mtu wako. You know what I mean? Dar, if you know you know. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching this video. Let's meet another time. Ni mimi host wako kwa kila siku Lilian Lema. Ah, uh, tukutane siku nyingine, tuka na topic nyingine. Kama you have So, kuna topic ambayo natamani niongelee. Wewe ukanitumia kwenye ukanitumia kwenye DM zangu za Emily SL taandika username yangu ya Instagram hapa au kai comment tu hapa kwenye comment below. Na kama umeenjoy the video, don't forget to subscribe, to share it and like. So, I love you so much. Let's meet another time. Bye.